What do you think is the future for a patient of tuberous sclerosis right now? Uh, that's a very exciting uh, question, actually, and a, and a wonderful one. I think in the past, what we had to do was treat what we saw, treat the symptoms. Now we can treat the disease. What's coming, and I feel very strongly about this in my lifetime, uh, and, I, and I hope I'm part of it, will be to treat so that you prevent the manifestations. I think we'll understand the biology better, understand why the disease occurs, and I think much of the manifestations will be able to be suppressed uh, so that, or prevented so that we're not worrying about treating the disease but rather preventing what could happen. So you're saying that the new generation is going to be with less uh, effects? I, th I think definitely. I think the natural history is already changing. I'll give you an example. Uh, children who are treated uh, with an mTOR inhibitor for SEGA, or, uh, for example, their renal manifestations are substantially less. That's not limited to mTOR inhibitors. I think that there will be other drugs too, other repurposing of drugs. So not, you know, 20 years of d drug development, but drugs that we already have uh, that will change the course of disease much for the better.